Oh, come back here, let's play Hot Wheels beat that. So, what is the special event of today? What is the game going to ask us to do? Is it going to use, tell us to use a Civic Car again? And it's easy if you use a Civic Car, so that's not a problem. I can do that, that's not a problem. EMP weapon. Sure. Actually, I get EMP pretty consistently, so... Hopefully, we're not going to have the same problem we've had before with never getting the weapon we need. I'm a little bugged by that. Alright. Let's get on going. Seems... I'm, I'm still not completely convinced. I'm not completely sure, or not, of whether the weapon that you get is actually dependent on which on your placement or not in your position because in a lot of games it is this one I'm just not sure the nice thing about the EMP though is I don't need to land on anybody I can still stay ahead and use it I use it from anywhere I didn't say I need a supercharging here or anything like that either oh hey I think that's the first time the shields actually helped me I just need to pick one up and then use it and if I can find a blue... Oh, now I remember. The bl blue goals are kind of hard to get a hold of here. There's only one that I really managed to find that I was actually able to do anything with. But I should be able to get it reasonably consistently. Just need to go oddly slow. But I tend to get EMP from those. And it should kind of get the super part supercharged version, I would think. Yep. Awesome. Goal two done. And now we can actually play this race normally, which of course basically just means doing nothing, because we're just gonna stay ahead and then that's it. But still, we can enjoy the scenery. Maybe even get to see a shortcut. Whoops. We managed to pick up a rocket or anything of that nature that can open up shortcuts. Look at that high resolution texture. Pushing the weed to its limits. Considering the lag, at least pushing my computer to its limits. I wish you could like boost through those walls or something like that. Through the, through the oh. through the shortcut walls, or use ice gun. That'd also be cool. But I don't believe that's possible. You can't smoke through it. I'm pretty sure. Oh no, EMP! Whatever will I do? More smoke? Of course. Man, game. You never do give me interesting items, do you? Oh, now nah, you give me parachutes. No way. Uh, of course, it would be a little bit more helpful if the rockets were more consistent about working too on shortcut barriers, because there have been times where I actually, as you've seen, where I've actually used a rocket on a shortcut wall and the wall just wasn't destroyed for some reason. But I guess we'll worry about that if we actually get rockets in the first place. For now, I swear. I, I, I need to complete like all the gas. If I hold the gas at all, I won't. I won't hit, I'll overshoot it. But once we actually get a rocket, we can worry about whether or not the rocket's gonna work for anything. Okay, I've been wanting this for so long. That was dumb. I didn't realize they were that close to me. I can still redo the challenges I lost pretty easily. I didn't think they were going to catch on to me that quickly. <laughs> I gave, the gave into the temptation. So some more wasted time. I will have actually gotten this one the first try too. I didn't. That MP's not going to do anything so really well. How many, why are there so many MPs? Why not? I guess that's because the EMP was still in effect, is what I was doing. Well, I almost got on the receiving end of a smoke screen from Danny. Which I've been seeing. I, it was kind of interesting seeing it happen at some point, but it's still yet to actually happen, I guess. So let's worry about EMPs again. Again, though, since I seem to get EMPs so often from blue. from blue rings, I won't, I'm not too concerned. As long as I can hit this ring again right here, I should be okay. Because that's probably what I'll get from this ring. 
but statistically speaking. Yep. Yep, both controls at the same time. Look at that. Oh dear. So we have confirmed that you can in fact fall into the holes. Now I really want to see if you can knock a golf ball into the hole now. Man, I know how bad of an idea that is too. Oh, look at those collisions. That was awesome. Like, I know it, I'm, I shouldn't spend time trying to do it, so I won't. Beautiful! But it would be amazing to actually knock the golf ball into the hole. Oh well. Get parachuted, bird. Ah. Wow, I didn't realize this was actually close enough to even use a puzzle on them. No way, Danny. Haha. <laughs> Swift revenge. Jeez. <laughs> I love it when the propulsion, then I get propelled forward by my own mind because somebody hits it right behind me. It does make me lose a little bit of a uh, boost, it looks like. Well, that's fine. It's well worth it. I thought I was using that boost for anything anyways. Well, not quite boost. Hot Wheels meter. Okay, I think there's still some things that aren't supercharged too, now I think about it. Just hadn't really occur uh, occurred to me to supercharge them. Mostly things I don't get very often though in the first place. Also, of course, Day has to be the one that's right, that, right behind me now. Oh no, there actually are two opponents left. These guys stay so close to each other. I can knock these golf balls into the into the holes, but I know I can't spend time trying to do that. It's very sad. This would be a wonderful thing to do. I'd feel very accomplished. It'd be a good way. It'd be a good thing to include an Easter egg for actually, just making something happen if you knock the golf ball into the hole. Or they could have made that a secondary challenge too. Actually, I think it would have made sense. Would it? Yep, that's how drifting works. Drift in the air. I just have to beep on for fun. I didn't expect to actually do anything. Okay, certain, only certain power-ups can be used in the air in this game. For some reason, a mine is one of them. Not quite sure why. Bye, Danny. Maybe, Danny. Okay. Rewards so, so seldom now. They're raising the stakes. They're not quite stakes. They're raising the standards. They're raising the bar. Make me collect so many wheels for each reward now. I feel overworked. I demand higher compensation. Okay. Still more Eliminator, but it's only the only Eliminator left. So hopefully with the RNG will smile upon us. Or they just won't give us anything that requires RNG in the first place. 250 hot wheels points and a jump should be okay. While holding a rocket. Don't want to use it. The worst part is that means if anybody uses a level 2 EMP, that it's gonna screw me up. First. Hopefully, that won't happen. We want way to find out. Okay, so off we go. So rockets seem oddly rare sometimes for some reason. Okay, so now we just need to hold on to those. How easy that's gonna be, I don't know. But it should be, it should be, uh, well yeah, it's just a luck thing really. This depends on whether or not anyone gets EMP. Level well, 2 EMP that is. So that mostly depends on whether or not there are any AI accessible blue rings. That's most of it. Normal rings, they can of course get as well. And then I think the AI can supercharge weapons themselves, maybe. Oh, it's so tempting though. I don't need three of them. I only need to have presumably one rocket on hand. So, using shortcuts. Whoop. Like that seems to me like a good idea. So we can actually see what the shortcuts are like. So I really do want you to do that. If it doesn't open, then I just won't go. 
That's really unfortunate, though. I don't know why that would be the case. Game being a little unreliable. Because I really want to see what was there. But I'm not going to trust that the game will actually give me another set of rockets. Ever. I'm convinced that that's the... So I have to say that I was convinced that was the most fun way to go through that loop. But of course, I forgot that also ran the risk of you losing your item. I forgot that falling would make you lose your item. Okay, so now you seem to worry about rockets again. Which may or may not happen at all. We'll just have to find out through sheer luck. So we'll just run around like we were doing before and see what happens. The right side is if we do get rockets again, we might have a chance of going through that one shortcut that I wasn't able to go through last time. Also, I don't know if I got the jump bonus that I wanted or not with 250. There's a good chance I did. If not, I know one place where I could get it anyways. If I can get to it from here in the first place. I have a guess as to where I could get it at least. Come on, boost would help, I guess. But it looks like this one attempt is kind of done for. It looks like we'll have had to redo it anyways, though, since I didn't actually get the jump on us, I don't think. But since I don't need to use item anyone, I can still have a chance at getting an item. Theoretically. No. I still do like taking this regardless. As long as I just take it safely like this. Okay, well that doesn't help me much. And wasting time so much on these things. Also we're at episode time again. And like last episode though, we're gonna end up wasting time by doing the same thing over and over again. Bothersome. Well, it is my own fault they lost the rocket. Ha! Of course! I love that actually that thing again, you have all people. Perfect. Okay, so... Thanks. Well, I could have used that EMP moments before. So now, though... We're just on the whole... Okay, so I'm slowing down, apparently. We're just on the whole waiting for... Draft, man. There we go. Waiting for... Rocket Sling again. Mostly. It would also help if I used Boost for getting that airtime bonus. But that's not a chief concern. But if I do get boost at some point, I'll actually wait to use it on a jump, I guess. Okay. So this, I will actually hold on to this time. In fact, I won't even do the corkscrew, I guess. Well, I've done the corkscrew every single time, so I don't even know which way you can go as an alternative. Why, though? There we go. Stole for myself. It's a victimless crime. Okay. But, um... Can you even go through without? Yeah, you can go through go through here without going through the corkscrew. I wasn't even sure. So my one idea then was... It looks like you get some serious air time. Maybe you didn't have boost off of this jump here. Ah, not enough though. Yeah, I might not be able to do this without getting a an actual boost item. Which really is unfortunate. I can say it means I'll have to do another one through because I'm not I'm not letting go of these rockets. I've kind of given up on doing this all in one run. We're getting both of the second objectives in one run. Which 
means it's gonna be an even longer ride than I thought would be. There we go. You know, in a certain way, it's actually more fun playing as so fast, I think. Occasionally losing control like that. Whoa, what's happening here? Speak of the devil, I guess. <laughs> That's not really what I meant when I was talking about losing control, though. I more meant, like, just, like, not turning as well. <laughs> that happens too, apparently. That's also entertaining. Just not necessarily exclusive to so fast, as far as I'm aware. Okay, so that's not part two. Man, the non-corkscrew path is kind of like a hidden path in its own right. But slower. The slow way is the hidden way. The peculiar. Okay. So now... Got goal two. Now we'll retry. Yes, and we'll hold on to a boost this time on a jump. Maybe even that jump that's at the end of the lap. And we'll use that for the jump bonus. Oh, there are a few other jumps that work this one too. I'm quite sure. But boosts are pretty common to come across. So not too concerned about this. RNG should be too much of an issue this time, I don't think. I think an ice gun also. I never did ice gun. It's one of the rarer ones for some reason. Okay. Ahead we go. Oh no, whatever will I do? I don't actually have any real application for my Hot Wheels charge either now I think about it. This hasn't been relevant lately. And two episodes through, we haven't even gone to the Rampage events yet. This is going a lot more slowly than I thought it would. All I need. Okay. It's always satisfying hearing my collision surely putting down a mine. Parachutes. No, man, you're just being insulted. Now then. Boost like you've been giving me constantly this entire time. This past 40 minutes, please. No, you can give it to me. I know you have it, it, have it in you. There we go. Okay. So let's hold on to this. I'll be careful while I go around this loop because it's a little annoying I'm trying to actually get this. But that should get to us. Yep! Whoa ho! Ho ho! It's like Christmas in here. That was interesting. But that means we have to go. So we can rest easy now. Nothing really to worry about. We'll just keep on going ahead like we have been, and all will be well. So in that case, why are there so many orange Hot Wheels tracks around? Oh, around the mini golf course, anyways. No, there's actually not much of it. I mean, it makes sense. Well, I don't know though, because it seems like the dinosaur is supposed to actually be like for the golf balls and whatnot. But then, yeah, because like the section of its back, for example. But then. We have a Hot Wheels track we can put. It's almost as if this wasn't made as a real Hot Wheels course, or as a real mini golf course. Um, this one probably isn't the most quick killer, but yeah. Shortcuts are cool. I wish I got a nice landing for that one. I feel like I deserved it. Why do you do this to me, game? Very briefly and last now. I don't expect that to stay the case, though. So, 
There we go. I haven't even seen my opponent. I oh, know I was still saying I was in second. This game thing seems to lag a little bit when it comes to updating a position like that. Okay, so there's still one alternate route I haven't really been paying attention to here. We're not going to get to see it, looks like, unfortunately. I think it's off to the right at the beginning here. Yeah, there's an alternate, alternate route off to the right. That gives you a blue ring. Anyways, so that'll be that for this very long episode. Let's play Hot Wheels. Beat that. I'll see you guys next time. Next episode when we, I don't know, actually we're going to finally start off on the Rampage events, which will be nice and quick. I'm pretty sure, maybe. We'll see. See you then, guys. Yeah, see, normally I would have around three episodes recorded by now, but I only have two. Awesome. Bye, guys.